Damon, you know as well as anyone how skilled that team is. Just talk about the effort to hold them at bay for most of this this game tonight. Yeah, it was pretty solid for the most part. Um, you know, they're going to get their chances, which they did at times. But I felt like for the most part, we did a really good job against them, and we had a couple good looks we scored on. And uh, unfortunately, we just couldn't hold them off a couple times there. But um, we had a couple shots at it, and even in overtime, we had a couple shots at it to, to end it. So. I don't think we can really um, be too upset with our game tonight. It's one of those games where you know we probably felt like we should des- deserve better. You also, when you, when Z goes down, you guys back there on the blue line had to pull a little bit tighter. Um, talk about that effort, just from from your perspective on the on the blue line. Yeah, it seems that like we can't catch a break right now with injuries. Um, it's just a tough bounce for him. So, yeah, we just had to pick up the slack. Obviously, going on five, you just try to keep uh, keep your shifts a little bit shorter, um, play simpler hockey, and um, take the take the chances when they're there. But um, for the most part, uh, I thought we did a really good job as a decor when he was in and then when he was out. It was a tough bounce, but um, yeah, you just you pick up the slack, you do what you can do, and and do what you have to to try to help the team win. What was this night like for you? It was fun. It was uh, come back, walking in the building for the first time in the different different dressing room, different doors, and I didn't know where a lot of stuff was. So, uh, but it was cool. Uh, very appreciative of my time here, and uh, there was a lot of great fans that were, you know, um, I think they gave me a little bit of a ovation for the most part. I didn't get booed, so that was a good sign. Um, I, I enjoyed my time here. Fans were great. Um, it's too bad that we didn't win more when I was here, but um, they got a really good squad now, and, and they'll be they'll be doing some damage here from, from now on. It looked like you took a little time to soak in that video as well and, and the way the fans welcomed you back. Yeah, sure. I mean, yeah, you just kind of want to say thank you basically is what it is, and um, they, uh, you know, the fans pay the admission to come watch us play, and and I'm very appreciative of that. And and uh, they're very uh, high demanding fans here, um, as they should be. They, they expect a lot, and as all fans should. But uh, it was um, it, it was a great time being here again as a visitor. Um, I'm happy where I'm at now, but um, you know, you come back and see all the guys get a chance to play against them, and see all the old faces. It's, it's fun. Uh, Damon, you guys, uh, I think you've had. Not to be the negative guy here, but the, I think it's 10 six on five goals in the first 36. You could look at it one of two ways, right? Uh, one is that you keep blowing leads and the games are slipping away. The other is that you're in position to win those games. Um, is it, I mean, how frustrating is it to kind of be in that position at this point? Yeah, that's something definitely we have to clean up. Uh, it seems like the six on five goals are all different though, which is something that's not like it's the same repetitive theme. Like, you know, you saw the one tonight was off the rush and, you know, Hughes comes down with a ton of speed. He just goes right through our forwards and then comes down and rips it. So that can happen, obviously. Um, but, you know, you, you play such a good game for 55 or plus minutes and then all of a sudden you're up by a goal and you just can't hold on. So that was that was an issue we had here when I played here with the Devils, clean that up and we started winning a lot more hockey games. and. Feels a lot much, a lot better. So um, that's something we have to find a way to do it here as well. If you guys have to uh, be without Zach for a while, I, I don't know what the injury is or whatever. But if, if he's out for a while, how tough can it be to replace him? Not just for the fact that he's so, such a good player, but he's also a lefty, and you guys got a lot of righties as well. Yeah, that's you're true. Yeah, you're bang on pretty much. Um, you know, I know a lot of coaches and a lot of players and teams want to have the lefty righty combo, and obviously that puts a a little bit of a wrench into things there, but um, you can't control injuries sometimes. It sucks. I, I've been out. Um, he's been out twice now, and he had a long year last year, so you feel for the guy for sure. But a uh, great player, and he was just kind of picking up his game again too, skating real well with the puck and, and making things happen. So uh, I enjoy playing with him. I know we don't play together quite often, but we get some chances every once in a while, whether um, you know, throughout a game we get pairs get mixed up. But uh, I feel like we got some good chemistry, and he's a guy we'll miss, but we gotta now we got to roll with the punches to do what we have to do to win. Your thought on the effort tonight, given you lose a guy, you got guys playing in different positions, it seemed like a pretty gutsy effort from you guys tonight. Yeah, I mean, we played a hard game, um, you know, pretty solid considering our day today and um, just didn't come out with the result we wanted, but um, yeah, I'm proud of the guys, how they worked. To come on the road and earn a point is says a lot, of, again, given the day you went through and, and everything else today, right? Yeah, obviously the point's huge, but we're, we're here for two. Um, just. Another case of third period, and that's that's it. Penalty kill seemed to be back on point tonight as well. Yeah, um, we, we we tweaked a couple of things. We we've got scored on a couple of times lately, but we're we're tweaking things constantly. Macker does a great job letting us know you know what they're doing and, and what to improve on. So it was a team effort tonight, and, and Elvis, you know, he, he played hard there for those PKs. You guys have, um, 
I mean, 36 games this season, you guys have given up a, a number of six on five goals. I know those are frustrating because that means you're close to winning that many games. Um, are, there, are there any commonalities that, you, that you've seen of, of why maybe some of those goals are going in and, and just how frustrating, I guess, is it? Um, you know, I don't really know. I don't handle that side of things of, of what to do. Um, it's just it just happens. I mean, we're, we're trying to block pucks. We're eating pucks. But at the end of the day, it's, um, you know, they're they're a good team and they have, they have elite level players that, that score goals. So we got to we got to find a way to finish games out and kill, kill those six on fives off. But that's it. The, the, it kind of go for overtime too. Uh, you guys have skill, obviously, but uh, um, I mean, it's it's kind of a wacky game in, in overtime, you know? Yeah, overtime is just, uh, I mean, it just happens. Obviously the puck was, was spinning on KJ there. He, he tries to, if he gets that puck off, you know, I, I got trust in KJ that he, he probably a good chance of that puck going in, and, and he had another look coming on the left side of the, the ice there. That, so it's just a, a matter of chances, and obviously they get a breakaway out of it. And what can you do? Jenny, just talk about the effort tonight. A pretty yeah. pretty gutsy effort as a team. Yeah, we played pretty good, but a little delay loss. Yeah, that's the good game to both sides. Yeah. How about your goal and what you saw going in? A great opportunity for you, which you buried. I don't know. I just tried the shooting, but. Yeah, it's good. That's good for us, and yeah, that's good. How uh, how frustrating is it when you guys get those kind of goals, and then the other team just kind of comes right back and, and erases it? Yeah, for sure, that's best for us. But yeah, we keep going. We just play every game, try to play better, and that's it. We're feeling, we're feeling the game. Do you have a feeling that you know the the fact that you're in these games so close uh, that once you figure this out, you guys can go on a run. Uh, yeah, just one Diddles game, and we just a couple mistakes off the end, and that's the final score. Yeah. You guys were good on the penalty kill tonight, and you were part of that unit. Uh, do you enjoy getting out there and getting the chance to kill penalties? Uh, sorry. You guys were good on the penalty kill yeah. tonight, and you played some minutes out there yeah. on the PK. Do you enjoy that opportunity? Yeah, for sure. I like to play PK. Have a try to chance uh, going to score a goal and but the first one it's uh, play good on the D zone yeah but that's good for me yeah, for sure when you score that late in the game and put your team up i mean what's that feeling like do you do you feel like you're gonna, you guys are going to win the game at that point that's what's going in your mind or? yeah yeah for sure we feel that but uh, i tell just a little mistake and that's the final score yeah i know you wanted the two but the effort tonight to get the point tonight from your team that that was um, a real good team effort. I mean, like guys battled hard. We lost Zach, Orensky midway through the game. So some guys had to take um, over. Our, our penalty kill was really good. We only gave up five shots. Uh, it's disappointing, uh, but the effort was perfect. Your penalty kill seemed to be back on point. And Justin Danforth mentioned there may have been some tweaks. To improve things, what did, what did you think of their overall play? Oh, they were good, really good. Um, our, our, uh, the way we protect the blue line is really good, but uh, managing the slot and taking away seam passes, um, real good job. The interchange between the forwards, the way our D are playing down low, real good job. Um, I believe this was the 10th the, the six on five goal in like 36 games. Um, doesn't seem like there's a lot of commonalities in, in how they're going in, no. right? Um, so when you sit here and look at that this early in the season, is it more frustrating, or is it? Do you look at it and say, well, I mean, we're in position to win 10, yeah. 10 more games? Well, it's a little bit of both. Um, so he's, he's that that kid was skating and he was coming in hot. Um, got cut in the change, um, so it left a hole open in the neutral zone, and they took advantage of it. Um, but you're right. So those goals are all a little bit different. And uh, we're studying different ways to play it. But there's no real tendency, except for early in the season, where maybe the low zone, the way we protected our low zone, we, got, uh, we took care of that. But tonight was completely different. How tough was it to see this ending for Elvis after he played, you know, so well for the 
vast majority of this game? Well, he, no, he was really good. I mean, he's made some saves early in the game and all through uh, throughout the game that kept us in the game. So um, it, it, it's disappointing, but I'm going to look at that game and I'm going to see a lot of good things um, from Elvis, from our defensemen, um, knowing that we lost a Zach. And um, the way we managed the puck, I thought we were playing fast tonight. We were... We played a real good game. With, with Zach, uh, is, there, is there any indi early indication that you've gotten so far? No, he's going to see our doctors tomorrow, so I don't know. How tough is it just to see him leave the ice like that? I mean, especially him, yeah. you know, the last two, three years. Well, he's... Yeah, and the way he was playing right now, it was just... Uh, he was dominant out there, so it's... It's going to create a big hole, but hopefully it won't be too long. Yeah. Does it add to that hole that you have to replace the fact that he's a lefty? I mean, we've talked about this for lefty righties. You guys have more righties. Yeah. Does that make it even tougher? Do you think? Yeah, no, it will be because we have a bunch of righties, uh, but we'll have to adjust. Um, it's part of it. Next man on.